The following is a two out of three falls match. Making his way to the ring from Birmingham, England, weighing in at 228 pounds, Kenny Hunter. Tensions riding high. Plans on getting things settled in the ring. I can't wait. He calls himself the standard bearer of this division and plans on proving it in a matter of moments. And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 192 pounds, the mailman. I'm going to come right out and say it. Yes, this athlete takes great appreciation in their own in-ring performances, but it doesn't make them a bad person. Who says it does? But on that topic, they're not my cup of tea. Actually, a little more like a cup of raw sewage, if we're being perfectly honest. Always walking around with a chip on his shoulder. He's going to use that anger against his opposition. A competitor must take the fight right to their opponent in a tables match or suffer the consequences. Corey, can you describe the trauma the body suffers when going to a table? Unfortunately, uh, yeah, I can. Imagine receiving a kickoff in football, running it back at full speed, and getting tackled by the entire opposing team. Which is exactly why a superstar cannot give their opponent a second to recuperate. You don't want to be on the losing side of that equation. Kicks to the lower back. Clutching the wrist. Just absolutely punishing their opponent here. Relentlessly. amount of offense against him here. This is where his fortitude will be put to the test. Oh, knee smashing the face. He knows how to avoid contact. Oh, a power bomb. A power bomb like that will leave you with bruises and remind you of this moment for days. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Oh boy, come on, not the chair. Into the corner now. Oh, what a kick. Vicious. He's taking some good hits. Yeah, Cole, but he's just focused on avoiding going through the table. That's all that matters. Into the ring again. And he'll lead the ring for this next stretch. And now he has all the time he wants. Byron, what is the thought when being locked in a submission move during the first fall? Do you fight through the pain or tap out quickly to lose the fall but avoid serious injury? Uh, tough call, Michael. If you can't get out or reach the ropes, tapping out only costs you one fall. An injury will cost you both. We often see the will to win drive competitors too far in a match like this. Sometimes discretion is the better part of battle. Worrying about getting a fall back is easier than rehabbing from a major injury. and gets out of there. And he goes into the ring. Uh, 
And he sends him into the corner. And the knee. Really just laying it in. Vicious stomp in the bottom turnbuckle. Oh. Look at this. All of their body weight down across the neck. And exclamation point. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yardstick. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. Launch it all the way to the outside. And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. He turns it around. Oh, colliding with a barricade. Oh, I had that well scouted. Nasty knee. Taking the fight near our announce table. I really hope we get these desks at a discount. Setting it up. Thunderous clothesline. Great strength being shown here. He continues to press forward. He is getting fired up here. Returning to the ring now. And he's taking this to the outside now. A running hurricane runner. Beautiful. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What impact. He's getting a little battered now. Ooh, man. And the damage is just going to keep on coming if you can't find the defense for this. And things are just going from bad to worse. This doesn't even look like trying to win a match anymore. This looks like trying to end someone's career. Cinches up the arm and it fishes and kicks to the jaw. Oh man, he has fired up now. Saving us from having to sit through that. Taking it outside the ring now. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. The WWE Universe giving him an Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. These are dangerous attacks on their own, but now the damage is exponentially multiplied. And he's able to reverse. Right across the face. Counter. And now there's an opening. Placed into the corner. He is obviously taking way too much pleasure in this right now. He leaves the ring and there's no countouts in this one. Ouch! He isn't finding any space to recover. He's got to wake up and get in the fight. Oh, gets put into the barricade. Now's the time where the smartest competitor needs to take advantage of the situation. Needs to figure out the quickest way to end this. Drop kick. Beautiful. Oh, what an uppercut. Yeah. And he continues to carry on through the pain. He is proving it will take a lot of work to keep him grounded for good. Kick right to the side of the face. Position here. 
Closed fist punch to the jaw. That's one way to break up a move. Kick to the body. What's coming next? Hooked up. Face first. Delivering elbow after elbow. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? And he tosses him back in now. The decibel level in here right now is breaking glass. These fans are on fire. Oh, right to the kidneys. He's setting the table up. This won't end well. Oh, hang on for dear life. Oh, you That might be it. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. I don't care what they say, nothing good ever comes from getting the tables. Whip back into the ring. see on their face at least they can say they won the match putting your body on the line like that is a huge risk this match could have gone very differently but in the end Corey they are the ones celebrating <laughs>